Yellowstone fans, buckle up, because the newly released Season 5 Part 2 trailer has left us all shocked. Why you ask? Well, despite Kevin Costner's departure, John Dutton is still front and center. How is this possible? How will his story end? And we have a massive update on the future of the series. Yes, you heard that right. Yellowstone is not cancelled. Stay with me, because there's a lot to unpack, and trust me, you won't want to miss a single detail. The NWLY release trailer starts with John's wise words, the kind we've come to expect from him. But isn't John Dutton supposed to be out of Yellowstone? If Kevin Costner isn't returning, how are they planning to give his character a proper farewell? Well, there are a few possibilities, and we're diving deep into each one. As we all know, Kevin Costner has officially announced that he's not appearing in the remaining episodes. Yet, the trailer still uses his face. Is this just clever marketing, or is there more to it? They could be using and used footage from previous seasons to keep John Dutton in the story until his inevitable exit. But the big question remains, how will Taylor Sheridan end John Dutton's story? Here are the few scenarios for John Dutton's exit. Scenario 1. Political Assassination John's role as Montana's governor and his fierce protection of the family ranch has made him a lot of enemies. So his enemies could take him out of the equation this time. Scenario 2. Betrayal from Within we all know Jamie and John have been at each other's throats, especially after Jamie tried to impeach him. Could Jamie strike a deal with market equities, or another enemy, leading to John's death? Scenario 3. Sacrifice for the family John Dutton has always put his family and land above all else. What if he sacrifices himself in a final act of protection? And it's one of my favorite speculation. If you have watched the video till now please watch it till the end as we have discussed about an official news about Yellowstone Season 6. So, whichever way John Dutton's story ends, one thing's for sure, Beth is most definitely stepping into his shoes. Ruthless, business savvy, and fiercely loyal to the ranch, she'll lead the family, while Rip will likely take on a vigilante role, seeking revenge for John's death if foul play is involved. Their leadership will be the heart of Yellowstone's future I mean she could lead us in Season 6 of Yellowstone. Jamie, on the other hand, could seize this moment to ascend politically, potentially becoming Yellowstone's next major antagonist. With John gone, the family will be vulnerable to new and old enemies alike, keeping the central conflict alive. Last November, it was officially confirmed that Season 5 Part 2 would be the last, and Yellowstone as we know it was done. The franchise would continue with a spin-off called 2024, later renamed the Madison. But now, guess what? There's been a major shift. According to the latest news, Yellowstone has been saved from cancellation. Yep, Season 6 is happening after Season 5 Part 2. And get this, Beth Dutton and Rip Wheeler are taking over as the new leads. Can you believe it? And while they were rumored to star in the Madison, it turns out they'll be continuing Yellowstone's original story instead. So, which scenario do you think will play out? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. With Beth and Rip leading the charge in Season 6, and Jamie potentially becoming a major antagonist, the stakes have never been higher. So, if you're excited about what's to come in Yellowstone, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates.